Hi, my name is Monica Vidal and I was born in New Jersey. I'm now here in Hawaii getting my PhD in second language studies where I'm studying how people transmit languages within their families. So what I really love about my research is so easy to answer. Um, it's really getting to spend time with the families that I'm researching. They have made me feel like I am part of their family. They just really want languages to be passed on in their families. They're very passionate about it. So when I was looking for programs um, to eventually get my PhD, University of Hawaii came up and I thought, oh wow. So I, I would say in a short answer, um, the, uh, the program is uh, top notch. Um, the faculty, the staff, the students are really uh, serious about their rigorous research and I really wanted to be a part of that. What inspired me to do this is that I thought I could impact uh, how teachers are trained, um, language teachers are trained. And um, uh, the SLS department at UH Manoa is, you know, the best program in the world for that. So I feel really lucky to be a part of it. Well, the Belinsky Foundation has really made a difference in several ways. Um, I would say the number one thing is that uh, by Getting a Belinsky Fellowship, um, it cuts how much time it's going to take me to do my degree so that I can actually get out there and start doing the work that I've been training for. Secondly, you know, of course, it frees up my time um, to not teach, which I love doing, um, but it allows me to focus on uh, transcribing, analyzing data, reading literature, and starting to write. Besides the Belinsky giving me the ability to do my research more quickly and to graduate with my doctorate more quickly, I'm also able to not have to take out as many student loans. So the Belinsky is not only helping me time-wise, but it's helping me um, maintain my debt to less than what it would be. <laughs> my name is Raina Heaton. I'm from Cincinnati, Ohio, born and raised, and I'm studying linguistics at the University of Hawaii at Manoa. So what I think um, inspires me other than just my personal sort of inclination towards languages in general is the fact that I really want to contribute to um, the struggle for endangered languages. I chose UH for two reasons. Um, one is definitely the program in endangered languages. So UH linguistics is number one for language documentation and conservation, um, I think of anywhere. And two is that I study Mesoamerican linguistics and this university had Lyle Campbell and he is my advisor. He is a specialist in Mesoamerican and South American languages. The Belinsky funding has been absolutely instrumental in everything I've done here. And in terms of my dissertation, having the time to sit down and just write, which I've been doing for almost a year now, is really amazing. I've gotten so much done already um, and I think my dissertation is so much better for it. It's um, longer, <laughs> it's uh, more complete. And so I've looked at this phenomenon that I'm studying in Kakshikel and now I've looked at it in 434 different languages. It's also for me created basically a database where I that I can pull from for the rest of my career now that I've had the time to sit down and create it. You know, so uh, it serves me very well, it serves the linguistic community better, um, and the department better, I think. 